now let us discuss about uh, xs3 code we know what is bcd code bcd stands for binary coded decimal binary coded decimal so the name itself specifies the meaning a decimal number is coded in binary form a decimal number is represented in binary form in bc notation the most commonly used bc notation is 8421 notation so we can represent a decimal digit with the help of four bits in bc notation so let we have a number like 72 so here 7 is one decimal digit 2 is another decimal digit so in order to represent 7 we require four bits and in order to represent 2 we require 4 bits. So, how we can represent 7 in 8421 notation? 0, 1. Next, how we can represent 2? 0, 0, 1, 0. Now, let us see about XS3 code notation. The name itself specifies the meaning XS3, an extra 3. So, XS3 code means we have to add decimal number 3 to the B3 number. So, XS3 means adding decimal number 3 to the BCD code. Let us see this table. So, here we have three columns. First column represents decimal numbers. Uh, we have uh, 10 decimal numbers from 0 to 9. And th these are the corresponding binary numbers in BC notation. Here we are using 8421 notation only. So, 0 means all zeros. 1 means 0001. 2 means 0010. 5 means 0101. 8 means 1000. 9 means 1001. Now let us write XS3 code for the corresponding binary codes. So what is 0 in BC notation? All zeros. So now we have to add 3. So now we will get 0, 0, double 1. So that is nothing but 3 only. So 0, 0, double 1. Next 1. So we have to add 3 to 1. We have to add 3 to 1. So 3 will 0, 1, double 0, 1, 1. So 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1. 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1. So, 10100. So, 1 plus 3 is nothing but 4. Next, 2 plus 3 means 5. So, 5 means 0101. 0, 1. 3 plus 3 means 6. 6 means 0, 0110. 0. Next, 4 plus 3 means 7. So, 7 means 0, 0311. Next, 5 plus 3 means 8. 8 means 1300. 0. Uh, next, 6 plus 3 means 9. So, 1001. Next to 7 plus 3 means 10, 1010. 0, 0. 8 plus 3 means 11, so 11 means 10. 0. 11 means 1011. 0, 1, 1. 9 plus 3 means 12, 110. 1, 0. So these are the corresponding XS3 codes for the corresponding BCD codes. So XS3 code means simply we need to add 3 to the corresponding decimal number or the corresponding BCD code. Now let us represent XS3 for the number 72. So, already we have represented in BC notation. So, XS3 means simply we have to add 3 to the corresponding BC number. Here we have 2 digits, 7 and 2. So, for the 7, we need to add 3 as well as for 2 also, we need to add 2. We need to add 2, okay. Uh, so, 72 plus, 72 plus 3, 3. So, what is the result? 7 plus 3 means, 7 plus 3 means 10. So, 10 means 1010. 0, 0. 2 plus 3 means 5. So, 5 means 5 means 0101. 0, 1. So, that is the result. So, 5 means so 2 plus 3. So, 2 plus 3 means 5. So, 5 means 0101. 0, 1. So, that is the result. So, you are adding. I am sorry. Here, what is the bit? 0011. 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1. 0 plus 1 means 1. 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1. So, 1 plus 0 plus 0 means 1. 0 plus 0 means 0. Next, 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1. Triple 1 means 1 1. 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1. So, 1. So, 1010, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1. So, 1010 0, 0 is nothing but what? 10. Whereas, 0, 0101 0, 1 is nothing but what? 5. 5. So, that is the result. Now, let us represent one more number in uh, XS3 notation. So, let the number is uh, 23.15. 
So let us represent XS3 code for this uh, uh, BC number. Uh, so first we have to represent 23.5 in BC notation. So each digit occupies 4 bits. So 2 in BC notation means 0010. 3 in BC notation means 0011. 1 in BC notation means 000. 5 in BC notation means 0101. Okay. 0101. Next we need to add 3 to each and every digit. So you add 3. 0011. 0011. 0011. So what is the result? So we have to add 3 to each and every digit. So 2 plus 3 means 5. So 5 means 0101. Next 3 plus 3 means 6. 6 means 0110 dot. Next 3 plus 1 means 4. 4 means 0100. 0. 3 plus 5 means 8. So 8 means 1 3 plus 0. So 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1. 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1. 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1. 0 0 1 means 1. 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1. 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1. Next 1. 0. Next dot 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1. Triple 1 means 1 1. So 1 double 0 means 1. 0. 0 plus 1 means 1. Next 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1. Next 0 0 1 means 1. Now let us see one more problem. Write. Write. BC notation. Write BC notation for the XS3 code. For the XS3 code. So this is the code which is given in the examination. Now we have to write. Now we have to write XS3 code for this BC number. So if we want to, if we want to uh, write BCD from the XS3 code, then simply we need to subtract the number with 3. Okay. So here what is the number we got? 0101. So 0101 means what? 0101. And what is the next number? 0110 0, dot 0100 0, 0. next 1300 0, 1, so what is this number this number is 5 this number is 6 this number is 1 this number is 5 so this is this number is uh, 1300 is nothing but 8 so this number is what 4 so 56 dot 45 48 okay now we have to write the BCD code for this XS3 code. Simply we have to subtract with 3. So 5 minus 3 means 2. So 5 minus 3 means 2. So 2 in binding notation is 0, 0, 1, 0. Next to 6 minus 3 means 3. So 0, 0, 1, 1. So this is 2, this is 3. Dot 4 minus 3 means 1. So 3, 0, 1. So 3, 0, 1. So this is 1. Next 8 minus 3 is nothing but 5. So 0, 1, 0, 1. 5. So 23.15. 23.15 is the corresponding BCD number for this XS3 code. Okay. Uh, now one more point is XS3 code is also called as unweighted code. So other name for the XS3 code is unweighted code. Why? Because if you take a BCD code. Here each digit is, each position is associated with some bits. So in BC notation means 8421 notation. So each bit is associated with a, a digit here. Whereas in unweighted, whereas in XS3 code, it doesn't associate with any weight. So that's why XS3 code is also called as unweighted code.